In the state of Oklahoma, they've waited 371 days for six little letters, but those letters are all in caps. This is Bedlam. Get ready. Four quarters of mayhem coming your way. Here come the Sooners. First down and 10 for the 25. Trey Sermon had a monster game a week ago, and he's got the ball, and he's got a big game on first down. Turns the edge, and he's down the sideline. Trey Sermon, and that's how you start a football game. Kenneth Edison Magruder ran him out, but not until Sermon ripped off 60. Deep number two. That's Murray, top of your screen. Wildcat. Sermon will take the direct snap and lower his shoulder into the end zone for a touchdown. And that's how this one starts. All on the legs of Trey Sermon. 6-0 Sooners. Side the 30. Here comes some blitz. Murray trying to get out of there. The escapability, throwing on the run and completing. It's Sermon out of the backfield on the receiving end. Just because you get in the backfield doesn't mean that you get Kyler Murray, and that looks exactly like Michael Vick. Second and goal inside the one. Kennedy Brooks making it look easy. His seventh rushing touchdown of the season. And Oklahoma back on top. Cornelius with some pressure up the middle. Throws for the end zone. It is caught. It's Tyron Johnson for the score for 31 yards. And we go back and forth. Fourth possession, fourth touchdown. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you there's going to be a lot of points in this game, partner. Yeah. This is just a, a, a ball that's thrown up. It's a 50-50 ball. And you can't blame Oklahoma State for taking this approach. Johnson just goes up taller than Trey Brown. Brown not able to locate the football. And they're in a position here to tie this football game with the extra point. These receivers free access, then Cornelius will take it every time. Watch the throw again. Down the middle of the field, has Wallace and has another touchdown. Beating Trey Norwood. Cornelius to Wallace for 49 of the score. And the Cowboys take the lead. Here's Brooks to the outside for the touchdown. Oklahoma State will get the football to start the second half. Every possession counts in this game. Kyler Murray knows that. Marquise Brown, touchdown. 51 to the house. It's Hubbard. You said they had plenty of time, and they score. Chuba Hubbard from just outside of Edmonton, Alberta, scores the touchdown, and the Cowboys aren't going anywhere. It's Hubbard. Good second effort, and he's in for the score. Put myself in that position, Todd. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I throw the ball to him. <laughs> or run out of bounds. Here's Murray to throw. Lost one, and it's caught. It's Marquise Brown. And the Cowboys are hanging on for dear life. A.J. Green got a cleat, and that's all. Gain of 39. On second and goal from the five. Zero's on the clock. They're going to want to play it. And the touchdown. Kennedy Brooks for the score. And Oklahoma back on top. Three to snap it. They get it away. It's Hubbard able to slice through for the score. Oh, 
So did so. The extra point, if it goes through, will mark the fifth lead change of the game. For now, we're tied at 41, Todd. I've just been impressed with this offensive line from Oklahoma State. We've talked so much about Oklahoma's, but it really started to take over the line of scrimmage, especially in the run game in the second half. That's Hubbard's third touchdown of the afternoon. Here's Matt Amendola. Oh! And he missed the extra point! There is no lead change. It's 41 all. Wow. Matt Amendola had been 42 of 43 on the season in extra points. And he misses this one. His slump continues in a big way. 41 all. Have the Sooners defense guessing. They'll keep it on the ground with Hubbard for five more. Down to the 35, the football comes out. Let's see. Oklahoma has it. It's Kenneth Murray, and that's the first turnover of this football game with 6.09 to play and tied at 41. Trey Sermon is in the game now. They give it to Sermon, crashing into the end zone for the touchdown through Calvin Bundage. The game's only turnover leads to the go-ahead score. Sixth ranked Sooners by six. Rushing three, Cornelius steps and fires, has a man, it's caught! It's Tolan Wallace indeed for the touchdown! And we are an extra point away from a tie football game. An extra point that Matt Amendola missed on his previous try. With 63 seconds left in regulation. Now the game wouldn't be over. Oklahoma still have plenty of time. Two timeouts and a minute three left. Here we go. Looking for the lead. Cornelius behind and knocked away. Trey Brown on the coverage. And the two-point conversion fails. I understand the design of this play, but it's a difficult throw for a quarterback. And Taylor Cornelius threw it way behind Tyler Wallace. He was there for a split second, just trying to run a quick flat. This is called spread right option. And you get on the move as a quarterback, and sometimes your accuracy suffers. And you see that ball needs to be out here. Instead, it's back here. And it's an easy play for Trey Brown. And Taylor Cornelius knows he missed it. Cornelius has had a brilliant game, 34 of 53. He's passed for 501 yards and needed two yards there passing. Still an opportunity here for the onside kick. You got to have it if you're Oklahoma State. As the guns go off, Marquise Brown and the Good Hands team able to recover the onside kick. Well, it's going to be a very interesting end of this season, but Oklahoma had to take care of business here tonight. They did it. It was close. But uh, give them credit. Give Lincoln Riley credit. They made the plays they had to win.